Hey guys, Steph from Infinite Combo here, and um, we finally got the Bayonetta and Corrin DLC tonight. Supposed to go up um, this afternoon, and we were kind of waiting with bated breath all day. <laughs> so, um, let's uh, finally check this out. So, um, those who know me know that I'm like this like huge Bayonetta fanatic. Um, I got the first game right when it came out. Um, second game, obviously, when it came out, both of them were fantastic. Platinum is one of my favorite developers, so when I found out that Bayonetta won the Smash Ballot, I was just, you know, over the moon. I'm gonna make my opponent Kirby just at, in hopes that, uh, he'll end up using his, uh, copy move, and we'll get Bayonetta Kirby, which is adorable. Sadly for me, I don't have audio right now, so I'm not gonna be able to hear the friggin' awesome music. Catwalk. Down, 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 down. Yep, just like in the direct, she's got her double jump just like in the game. Yeah, her basic right smash attack is actually kind of sluggish. It's actually a full on wicked weave. And then. So that's nice and intuitive. So then the down smash is her boot stomp. Another wicked weave. So that's good. So all the side smashes are wicked weaves. So that kind of will make it easy for me to remember this as I try to get good with this character. Um, obviously, B to shoot. And she switches between her hands and feet. Um... But up and B is, of course, her triple jump. Down B is... Now, I'm not sure if this is the special dodge that is supposed to give you the opportunity to do witch time, or if you can do that with any of these dodges. Um, I guess we'll find out once I'm kind of bored of training mode. So then side B is a slide... And let's see those air attacks. Oh! <laughs> right, so, I mean, again, that's kind of what you would expect it to be. Now... Okay. I didn't know if this was gonna be a stage with, like, interactive enemies that you could attack. Um, or, cause you know, you do fight him in Bayonetta, but it looks like he's just there for show. When you get some errant platforms. Um, so yeah. Down air, side air, up air, and neutral air. All right. And just like in the, uh, just like in the actual Bayonetta games, when you, uh, when you hit the button to fire, and you hold it afterwards, she continues to shoot for a while, so that's... I really want to get good as this character. It's certainly gonna be an adjustment, because I'm used to playing as characters who have crazy good recovery, and... Her triple jump actually, like, doesn't have a lot of, like, vertical movement to it. It's kind of just a very short burst, like, like even down there, I'm, you can't come back. So, all right, well let's uh, let's try an actual game. I can't wait for the amiibo of this to come out. By the way, so excited! Really makes me happy that this was the character that won the Smash Ballad because, um. Yeah, Bayonetta's kind of popular, but not that popular, and considering that Bayonetta 2 was obviously the first time that the series was on a Nintendo console, it was kind of like, okay, well, how many people are gonna actually vote for her? Um, but you know, she was a really good fit. What are our palette swaps here? That can be Jean. 
I honestly prefer her uh, her look from the second game. I'm going to have Kirby as my opponent again. Do I want to bring an amiibo out? So, this isn't maybe the best idea I've had, but let's just do a short five-stock match. All right, see what you got, Kirby. And when, of course, when she takes damage, the rose petals come out of her just like... Oh, and you can go on a platform underneath the stage. Special delivery for Kirby. Come and get it. I'm not gonna go down there. I'm gonna die. Oh. Probably should have taken items off. Ugh. Oh, yeah. Oh, and you can kind of do the jump to the side. Okay, that would have been nice if I realized it sooner. Enough of the bat. Speaking of bats, bat within, probably, like, the most crucial, like, technique in Bayonetta. Because it makes dodging way more forgiving. And I believe... I believe in the direct. Um, they were showing not just Fortitudo, but like some of the other bosses from the original game as well, so... Now her Wicked Weaves are obviously like very slow to get off. Kirby Netta! Yeah, really the best thing you can hope for, for speed, um, for, like, quick attacks is just, you know, the standard A. And even that's not, like, compared to most characters, like, rapid neutral A attack, it's really not all that, um, doesn't help them fighting a level 50 amiibo. It also seems like I cannot hit Kirby with my, uh, with my gun attack. Because, well, he's too short. Well, let's see if I can get some witch time going. I don't remember if it's just her final smash. No, you know what, I actually just... Whoa. I actually just remembered her final smash is, um, the demon summon, so, like, um, Gamora, mainly the dragon, which is the very first one she summons in the games. Yeah, see, like, I feel like people were probably expecting this to be, like, a Zero Suit Samus clone, because they're both kind of, like, sexy, tall, lean women that are, like, kind of, like, supposed to be agile, but she's actually, like, a little clunky just because, you know... It turns out that summoning a demon from hell made out of your hair to punch you with a giant fist actually, like, takes a little bit of time. Ha <laughs> ha! See ya! And, of course, her signature dance moves for her taunts. Ooh, uh. I feel like I could get the hang of this. I mean, hell, I play as Rob all the time, and he's really slow and heavy hitting as well. It's just he has, like, amazing recovery, too. Whoa! So, level 50, Kirby kicks ass. Um, yeah. Well, that was my little test run with Bayonetta. Um... If she's your cup of tea, definitely go and download her on the Wii U. Yep, yeah, so, um, if you buy her just on the Wii U with her, um, with her new stage that I was just showing off, it's, what, it's, um, $5.99. But if you buy it 
on both the Wii U and the 3DS, it's only $6.99. So you pay an extra buck to get it on both systems. Pretty good if you still play Smash 3DS a lot. I personally don't, but... All right, well, I'm definitely going to sit here and uh, keep trying to perfect my skills with her. But um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Stay infinite.